Aloha, today we're going to be talking about some of the best places to eat on the Big Island from the Waipio Valley to Kona and Hilo. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more travel content before we get started. First up on our list is going to be the Coffee Shack. This is on the Kona side. We went here before we went snorkeling. Great brunch spread and you cannot beat the view from here. Highly recommend coming here for breakfast, lunch, and getting a slice of pie to go. We got the coconut cream, the passion fruit cheesecake like you see here, and the mac nut pie. All of them were amazing. Um, as you can tell, my family really enjoyed these pies. <laughs> Next up, we're going to head to the Poke Shack. Now, I don't have video from the outside here. I don't know why, but I had done takeout so that we could eat it at the hotel. The poke from here was really, really good. A huge variety, and the Hawaiian pork was amazing, too. And Olivia was a big, friend, big fan of the shrimp. Next up, you cannot go to Hawaii without shave ice. We loved the shave ice from here. We just thought one Aloha had the best consistency, all natural flavors and their juices. It was so good. And you can even get ice cream done inside of your shave ice. I'm a big fan of the Ube ice cream. So much so that after my family ended up tasting mine, they had to get some of their own. Next up, we're gonna head up to the fish and the hog. This is Hawaiian barbecue at its finest. Everything we had here was absolutely wonderful, especially the banana pie at the end. That was definitely Olivia's favorite. I'm quite surprised she let us get any at all. And I will say they also had pretty good poke here too, just to note. Next, we're heading over to Hilo, the poke market. This is hands down the best poke that I had in Hawaii and the ube salad that came with it. Hands down, probably our favorite spot on all of the islands that we went to. After this, we went over to a little vintage shop and then we walked up to another favorite, which is Makani's Magic Pineapple Shack for some unicorn cones. This is something that I got on my first trip to Hawaii a couple years ago that my daughter begged and wanted to go to. Jeff got a shake, I got a unicorn cone. It's just magical. And I'm so sad that I did not take more of a video, but Two Ladies Kitchen Mochi, there is a line outside, there is a reason for it, so you do not miss this spot in your next trip. If you have any questions, please leave them down below, and if not, I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.